Okay, so again, this is what I use for looking at our sunny islands. So one is a master, one is a slave. Uh, we're running two of them parallel. So <clears throat> same thing again. These are connected by Ethernet, but I don't see any reason why not. It couldn't also be connected by Wi-Fi. Okay, so so long it exists on your network and you can access it from any of your straightforward um, web paging, okay? then um, theoretics, you could still do this. Okay, and again, it's just showing you very quickly, just major, the, 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 the main things you wanna look at, uh, how many amps is it doing, how many volts is it doing, what's the frequency, is the generator on or off, is everything okay or not? You know, these are the main things that it wants to see. Bear in mind as well, why, okay, if you utilize big trim, and then you utilize uh, Sunny Island. There is a difference because, uh, let's take it on power discharging from your battery. Okay, they all connect to the battery. And they should all theoretically come back with the same answer as what you are drawing from the batteries, okay? The difference is that one, it's what you call resolution time, so that data is not instant, is one. Two, is that has Sunny Island built in in its data for efficiency loss, okay? So, I mean, it might be the most efficient, but at the end of the day, there's still gonna be, I don't know, say 98 to 95% efficient. So the power that you're seeing drawn um, from your battery may not actually be the real figure, okay? It'll be uh, maybe, in our case, I think it's like, um, 40 watts per sunny island um, give or take i think that's what they use just to keep themselves powered up okay so these are the other things that you need to also think of what is the <clears throat> what is the data that you're looking at how how truthful is it and it's truthful for that piece of equipment but it may not be truthful for your batteries as a whole okay